What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm back with another episode of Everyday Kicks. Tis I, Brian Lyrics. And can you tell, I got something big for you today. You and 33 Hot Classic. In the late 80s, legendary basketball player Patrick Ewing teamed up with a gentleman by the name of David Falk to create the Ewing Athletic Company. In 1990 is when they released the Ewing 33 High, which I'm you know, showing you today. Now, not being backed by any of the major companies like Nike's or Adidas, you turn down Adidas, um, Ewing created a style like no other. Like, Really, like I, the shoes he has in his collection, I've never seen anything make, made like these shoes. Um, Nike don't have it, Adidas don't have it, Puma don't have it. Ewan just made his own style when he ran with it, and they definitely did a good job with it. As for this release, it released sometime in the late 2020. This black gold, and they call it icy white. Like, they're so dope. The black neoprene canvas-like upper is definitely a good look for the way the shoe looks. It, it's a good start for a classic shoe. Because of the materials, I think you can kind of wear with just about anything you want to put on with it. Um, I really believe you can go from jeans to hooping shorts. I don't want to say it's to a pair of slacks, but maybe a pair of khakis with this. This is a really clean looking, uh, multi-directional type look. Now, when you move on down to that gold patent leather, that just brings it, that just bring the swag to it, man. It's, it's, it's cool, it's a cool look. Like, you can't go wrong when you put a little patent leather. Patent leather. I honestly don't typically like patent leather on shoes. I don't like it when it's red or blue or whatever. Like, it just, but something about these making it gold makes it feel more official. Like, gold patent leather, it shines. Gold exposure shine. It makes sense to me. Not really sure how they call it, but they have the bubble gum finish on the sole, and even on the midsole, it comes all the way up to the midsole and wraps around to the bottom of the sole. The icy is what they call it, the icy color. It's basically a clear bubble gum finish on top of a white sole, and it's clean. I can't say anything bad about this. I love the way they have the black on black on black right on top, where they got the black um, logos branded on the tongue. I like the way they had the white branded on the side of the shoe. Then they had the strap, which is also multi-directional. So it like works both ways. You can either strap it on the back or you can strap it around the front. Either way, it gives you a good look. Black laces. This is a really, really clean shoe. Like, I wish I got a pair. I didn't order this one. This is not mine. These are not mine. I don't even think I can get them now, though. Um, unfortunately with this shoe, right? I always try to show y'all shoes that you can get. And, Everything you can get under about $200 when I basically can try to keep that range. But these, man, I took a little long to do the review on it. I had them in my hand for like three weeks. And when I had them in my hand, like they were on sale. They were actually on sale on the webpage, on the Ewing webpage for about 100 bucks from I think 130 125 130-ish. But I went back recently, can't even find them. They got like one size left. Just happen to be my size. Maybe I can slide them on real quick if y'all don't buy them before I do. But um, yeah, you and athletics.com. I usually don't just speak it in the video, but I will put it in the description. It may be kind of hard to find this particular colorway, but it's definitely not hard to find a shoe. Go to you and athletics.com. I'll put it in the description and I want to see what y'all think. I want to see y'all's. I want to see what you're thinking about. Follow me on IG. I'm Brian Lyrics. And let me know. As for the day, these are the Ewing 33 highs. And these are my everyday kicks. Hold up. Before I forget, let me give you my official rating. 1 being the lowest, 5 being the highest. 
please leave your rating in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And most importantly, tell a friend to tell a friend.